What's up you guys and welcome to today's video. Um, I am in a little bit of a rush because I only have a few minutes of daylight, but excuse my voice, I am a little bit sick and under the weather, but I wanted to film this video for you guys because I did commit myself to Tuesday and Thursday uploads. I just have a lot to do. Why am I doing this so much? Anyway, if you're new here, wow, I'm all over the place already. Welcome to my channel. If you're not new here, thank you for sticking around all this time. I feel like literally my four recent videos are the only ones that even look like me right now because I look so different from when I was like white bleach blonde and I feel like my hair looks way healthier like this. Why did no one tell me to stop dyeing my hair? Just kidding, I'm pretty sure everyone did. So without further ado, let's jump right into it. My first favorite is what I'm wearing right now. It is this cropped sweater from Target. Target, now they have it in a couple of colors, but I'm obsessed with this one. I would say it runs true to size and an extra small. And with Target, you can use their store locator and you can find out like what is at what store. Like you could see if this is at your Target before you decide to go there and hunt it down. Next up, if you've seen my Lulu's haul, then you've seen these shoes. They've got a little bit, bit of a platform, so the platform goes like up to here. But um, I would say like they're actually still pretty good for walking around in, like despite the fact that they are a platform shoe. Like I've worn these shoes all day before and have noticed like no problems. Plus like they're really breathable because of this zipper and I feel like you can unzip them and they still like, they don't look weird that you've unzipped them. So there's those, those are from Lulu's. They're Steve Madden six and a half, totally true to size. Next favorite, my purple shampoo. I literally almost just said red shampoo by Redken. Um, I had noticed that purple shampoo totally dried out my hair. Like I literally hated using purple shampoo because um, even though it gave my hair like a little bit more of a, you know, not silver, but like it got rid of the brassiness. I did feel like purple shampoo really dried out my hair, but this is the purple, this is the first purple shampoo I have found that hasn't done that. Um, I know a lot of people like when you start recommending one, they're like, oh, try this one, try this one. But like, this one has worked for me. I really like it. So yeah, I picked this up at Ulta. And next um, favorite that I get asked about a lot is the lip colors that I have layered on right now. I have on the Too Faced Overexposed. Um, it's like a kind of a buttery lipstick. Mm, we're not going to focus and I'm not going to waste my time, but it's kind of like a buttery... Um, lip butter type of lipstick and then on top of it I put over this um, matte queen bee like little liquid thing on top to get like the color and the texture that I want so I layer these two together and that's been like my go-to for a year now next beauty favorite is this Urban Decay D Slick makeup setting spray oil control Literally, I can't open this and not spray it. So the thing about this one is that it is temperature controlled. So like in the winter when you're going in and out of like 30 degrees outside and like fucking 70 degrees inside, um, your makeup isn't going to like heat up and expand and then like freeze onto your face. It just like helps keep that temperature. Oh, what's going on back here? Oh, we just, oh. We got all weird with the lighting. I know, Bruiser, it sucks. Um, but anyway, it keeps it from like getting all weird on your face because of the big temperature changes. This is also really useful like in the summer. So I am trying like to be rushy, but also not. But I just really should have set aside more time to film this video because I really just shot myself in the foot here, didn't I? Okay, next favorite. I have really been loving this um, activated charcoal toothpaste. It's black and it's horrifying to be washing your to be washing your teeth, to be brushing your teeth with black tooth, black toothpaste. But I feel like the charcoal in it like really, really helps keep your teeth white. Like I'm, I drink a lot of coffee and wine and like I shouldn't be doing that because I should just wanna keep my teeth white by not drinking those things. But like, I'm not gonna stop drinking coffee or wine. So I don't love whitening my teeth with um, like white strips and stuff cause, just cause I feel like it's not super good for your enamel. But this is like a more natural, teeth whitening toothpaste. I don't know, I love it, I get it from Target. And all the beauty things I got from Ulta. Next is a food favorite, it's super random, but Dave's Killer Bread does a low calorie, like a thin 
sliced bread. It's only 60 calories. I know a lot of people really love the Sara Lee, like 35 calorie or 45 calorie bread, but this just actually tastes like real bread. With You know, the Sara Lee bread like literally falls apart and you're like, okay, sick. Um, this is actually like dense bread. It's, it's thin for bread, but it's like pretty dense for like the fact that it's a low calorie bread. I literally just got Botox last week and I feel like it raised this eyebrow back up, but now I feel like this one looks funny, but I'm like loving the fact that it fixed what was going on there because this one, if you watch my videos, you can tell that that one had been like drooping. Not drooping, but like not as arched right now and I'm, I'm loving how arched this one is right now. It just makes me wanna talk like this. <laughs> anyway, my next favorite is my Movement Blue Light Glasses. I talked about these a few videos ago. I do not have a discount code or anything. I literally bought them with my own money, but I've been wearing them all day. I'm gonna wear them for the rest of the video because I want to, and um, they have totally helped save my eyes from like getting getting really bad headaches during the day just from like being on my phone being on the computer they block that blue light that's really harsh on your eyes and i love them my last favorite is actually what i just dropped on the ground my airpods i literally don't know how i worked out <clears throat> without headphones oh okay for so long the airpods have changed my life they're the only headphones that stay in my ear like the gummy ones and like all those weird headphones that are like the wireless ones that stick in your ear, go around your ear, like none of those stay in my ear. Like believe me, I've tried them all. Um, and AirPods are the only earbud I have found that stay in. Even like when I do sprints and stuff, these things stay in my ear. If you don't like the normal earbuds for iPhones, I wouldn't suggest these, but I'm a big fan. If you haven't tried them and you're like me and you have a very specific ear, the only i swear i've tried every single headphone the only headphone that stays in my ear is like the ipod ones it's like ipod used my mold used my ear as a mold to create their headphones i swear so if you haven't tried these i highly recommend i don't ever have to worry about charging them because they have the same charger as um like they they plug into where your iphone or it's like the same hole as what the iphone would be um and then they're always charging in this little thing so you charge like this charges them and then you charge the pod and i feel like it's just easier to keep up with because it's not like an extra cord that you have to worry about you can like you know plug these in in your car on the way to the gym or like you know while you're sleeping whatever i just feel like they're super convenient so that's all my favorites i'm looking around i'm sorry for this being like kind of short and sweet but i wanted to just list off um for you guys like some favorites that i've really been um using for a while now but that because i haven't done one of these videos i don't feel like i've talked about so oh, anyway thank you guys so much for watching i'm about to sneeze but i'm going to try not to if you guys enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe. And I will catch you guys in the next one. Bye, guys.